Hey crafty friends, welcome back to my channel. So, uh, this video is to share with you um, a, uh, well, a few things that I won from Miss Ivory, who is Ivory Creations. I'll have her um, YouTube linked in the description if you want to check her out. If you don't know who she is already, you are missing out, I'm telling you. She has the most beautiful creations. She's very talented. She has a shop. Um, she owns her own small business. She creates some of the most beautiful things I've ever seen. And she, um, she creates and sells, like, her own little ephemera and fun cards. And just, there's a few other things that she has, um, you know, designed and created on her own, out of her own mind that are super unique and fun to have in your crafty stash to play with. So you should definitely hop on over there and check her out. Um, so the first thing, so, um, if any of you guys do know who, um, uh, really is, she has had done some giveaways. She often does giveaways. Um, and I can't remember exactly which one was for which giveaway, but she does random giveaways. Um, she does subby rewards, um, like member benefit type things. And recently she did her, um, uh, scavenger hunt games were back so i won a couple of different things from her some were random um didn't even know it was going to be a giveaway but because you know i watched it and commented and you know stuff like that so she is super generous and very kind so one of them the giveaway was actually for this let me see if i can turn it around and show you oh goodness Look, Kelly, go ahead and break it, why don't you? All right, so she created these, um, this, oh, what did she call the ball? Um, sprinkle puffs, I believe that's it. So she made these, she created this herself. Um, she used clay and created her little, um, balls. And then she went in and hand placed every one of these sequins one by one. And cured them on there with resin. Is that not so beautiful? Look at all the colors. And it's like pastel vibes. It is super gorgeous. So she created these. I think it was her son. Help her come up with a name. And then she's got this cute little star charm. And she attached a little three layer tassel here that matches. And this was what she was giving away for this one. And she wanted to send more than just, you know, just a little keychain, which I would have been fine with it because it is gorgeous and I love it. Um, and this was on her little package. Congrats on your win, Miss Ivy Lee. And in that same package, she also gifted the winners a sample of her um, crinkly scents. Y'all, oh, I wish it was... Oh, I smell it already. I wish there was smell -o vision I'm kidding you not. This smells so good. She creates this herself. She makes crinkly, um, scented, um, these little crinkly papers for your Happy Mail. She calls it, uh, fragrance for your Happy Mail, I believe is what she calls it. And it is so fun to open a package and smell this and have this fun crinkle paper in there. So yeah, she included a little bag of it. A little sample and it is it smells so good I really wish you guys could smell it right now so then she also created these little mini um, uh, I don't remember what she called it if it's a mini flip book just a little uh, maybe a mini um, binder rail so she created um, I think there was five or six winners and she created them all different um, in the same form like this with the base and measurements but different and so this is the one I got she made a shaker back here, and it's the beautiful sequins that match her sprinkle puffs, and this really pretty flower ephemera on the front, gorgeous little good bo gold bow, fierce, brave, and strong, amazing, a little uh, jewel there, and she also um, stitched and made the rest of it a shaker as well. This is beautiful mind, happy spirit. Shake her there, and it says, happiness is where you are. And so, let's open this up. 
she kind of gave a sneak peek as to what was going to be stuffed in these um, little binder mills. So I don't know exactly what's in here. Okay, so the first page she's made, she has sewn. She stitched these all herself. She made a little acetate pocket and she has stuck in a few little cut aparts. So smile first, love, make today great. A striped heart on gold, super cute. That rocked. Yeah, so those are super adorable. On this page, she's attached a little embellishment. I, she created this as well. It is a bottle cap, but it is, let's see if you can see that. It's almost um, perfectly smooth, but she's filled it with resin and put like glitter flakes and sequins. So beautiful. And then one of her little bows, and then she's popped these on with a little dot so that we can remove them and use these embellishments. Super cute. And then on the next page, she's created this little shaker here. It's got some little gold sequins in it. And then over here, I believe this, yes, it comes off as well. So she created this little tag and it is a shaker. Let's see, those do move. So again, it's the sequins that um, she created with her sprinkle puffs and it says, no worries, be happy. Cute little gold puffy bow up there and she's stitched around the tag super cute i love how she just popped these in here like that so we can take them out and until they're used they're in this cute little um its own storage type thing so yeah and then over here is a little does this one come off yes i believe it comes off as well it's just a little um a little frame with some floral image in there and then look at this you guys look at her itty bitty little rosettes um actually i think she said these were from uh lori who's creating for fun but they are so stinking cute look at that i mean they're not much bigger than well a little bit bigger than my thumb but they're so stinking cute so there's two of those in there pink with the gold centers another frame over here with a different shape in florals and then on this page She's attached some of um, their little, uh, the little embellishment buttons that come from different collections. She has popped some in here on their foam, on the foam, so we can pop those off and use those ourselves. Super cute little buttons, and the colors are so pretty. And then over here, she's attached a few of the Maggie Holmes resin hearts. Beautiful, love, love, love them. Anything Maggie Holmes. And especially the gold glitter absolutely gorgeous and then on the next page is another rosette from Lori super super pretty and then the last page she's created another pocket that kind of um, she stuck a few little goodies in so got a few tags there fish tail banner and they come apart a floral ephemera piece. Love that vintage look to that one. Another small postal label. And then, oh, it's like a little, hmm, like a little collage of vintage. It was like a stain there, camera, vintage camera, and the photos. Love that. Love, love, love that. Another floral piece. A little vintage camera and then a couple of little words so that is what was in miss Avalee's super stinking cute mini binder happy mail binder mail let's see i'm not sure i can tie that back right now but i'm gonna sit it over here so that was um, what she sent me for the first one. Um, I was waiting until I received my other giveaway prizes from Miss Ivy Lee before I did a video. And those have arrived. So I want to share those. So on the front here, this all came in one package. On the front here, congrats on your win, Miss Ivy Lee. 
so there were what I believe it was two different um, random giveaways that we didn't quite know it was a giveaway um, and it was gonna be just a surprise and that's what these two are so I got the love you remarks um, Maggie Holmes chipboard embellishments and these super stinking cute chasing dreams uh, puffies thank you so so much so much I really I love anything Maggie especially these chasing dreams that collection's hard to find. Thank you so much for that. Thank you, thank you. And then another, I want to hear, I know this one was a scavenger hunt game. And um, I had the correct answer. And the prize was uh, these two packages of her ephemera. She has designed and cut these herself. They're so stinking cute. There's a whole ton, ton of them. So I'm going to share them right quick with you. So, um, she kind of makes her own little, um, collections, you'd say. Um, and I know one of them was, um, bubblegum something. And I'm not sure, I'm not sure if this is from that collection or not. But anyway, so that you get this cute little candy piece. They're all on sticks. This cute little pinwheel. And I believe, if I'm not mistaken, she uh, sells these in her shop. You, you would have to check it out. I'm not 100% positive. This cute little banner here. And then, let's see. Look at these little balloons. So cute. Aren't they adorable? And then you get a few of these little signs, like this way, that way, this way. Super cute. Those will be fun to um, stamp different words on. And then here's a couple of more balloons. Love, love, love them. And then here's a banner. And that actually matches with this little um, carousel. Is that a carousel? carousel? Ferris wheel? Ferris wheel. It's a Ferris wheel. Sorry. <laughs> Super cute. So that was one of the ephemera packs. And then the other one is this here. And love these little frosted polka dot bags super cute okay so let me grab a few and start off so there's a cute little candy and a macaroon um this one says the original of cool that is so cute a little rainbow on the coke can Let's see a popsicle i believe this is a grapefruit another macaroon See strawberry, uh, cotton candy, little popcorn, Let's see here we've got I believe this is a slice of cake and it's like shaped like a heart and then some milkshakes and here's another one it's like a little boba tea I think that's what it's called but it's got the colorful ones in the bottom let's see another macaroon Cherries, a little drink, just a few more cherries, strawberry, um, a little coffee. It says, I like you a latte. And then this is so cute. Look at this little pudgy faced, super adorable pastel unicorn sitting on the little, I don't know if that's a macaroon or a cupcake, but it is super stinking cute. And oh, I also wanted to tell you that. These are sturdy. Um, she doesn't just print these on copy paper or regular like 65 pound cardstock. She does her ephemera on 110 pound cardstock. She pays attention to detail and she wants her things to be sturdy and they really are. Here's another one. Cute little unicorn inside of a donut. Super cute. So here is a little slice of cake, a couple of candies, a lollipop. That is a donut, and that, it's got berries in it, so I'm not sure if it's supposed to be like a drink or if it's supposed to be like a jam, but it's still really cute, and that looks like a um, grapefruit on a stick, and then this is like a, reminds me of a cinnamon roll, but with pink and then like, you know, little dollops of frosting on top, super adorable, 
And then there's a little candy apple. Super cute. And then a donut. A ticket. And then, oh, this is so cute. This is like a little uh, gumball container. And then you get, this is fries before guys. Super cute. A little um, stack of macaroons. Here are a couple of donuts. And then, I believe this is cotton candy. A little uh, popcorn. And then the word cotton candy. And then like a little uh, carousel horse. And then this one says unicorn frappe. Super stinking cute. And then let's see a strawberry. And then the word, um, it says Ferris wheel. And then another jar with strawberries in it. So those are so fun. And I'm so, so excited to have Miss Avalee's um, ephemera. <laughs> I have other things she's created for me on my wall over here. And um, speaking of, there, this next thing here, um, I believe it was with this. And this is one of her uh, little embellishment jars. And when I pulled this out, um, Billy, my fiance, knew who um, who this came from. Because he's seen me open other mail from Ida Lee in her uh, resin creations. And he knew that she created this. Uh, because, you know, she just, she has a certain style, and she's very good at it. So, yeah, before I could even say anything about this one, he had mentioned it being from her. So, I just thought that was sweet. But she's got a little flower in there, some sequins, a bow. Super cute. And then on her embellishment jar here, she has some uh, pink and white twine. Tied on with this super cute little um, heart piece. And I was trying to find something to pull it. Oh no! I'm dropping things. I'm dropping things. To pour the things out on, let me do this. Just a moment. Okay, so I'm going to use this little uh, trinket dish that I recently got. Really good idea for this. All right, so I'm just going to go ahead and pour it out onto here and show you guys what's in it. So there's a cute little, I believe all these resin pieces, um, I believe she created them. So there's a little heart, I mean a little flower. Um, Pom-pom, there's a few more pom-poms. That is a pearl. Let me just just do this okay so here's a little pink flower here with a rose in the middle super cute this little uh, resin piece she may not have made that one she may have purchased that one but super cute little green um, kitty cat and then the pom-poms see there's a tiny gold um, resin bow super adorable there's one of those bows that she used on her um, embellishment book. Some little um, acrylic diamond pieces. Super cute. Here's another um, little shaker resin piece. I could just add a bell on there and use it as a small charm. Let's see. A few more pom-poms. Here's a little another flower really cute there's a little um, watermelon clay piece this is a little resin piece here made out of glitter it's a little lollipop super adorable a couple of more gems this is a bead chain and I can't remember exactly um, what it was I'll have to go back and look um, but I remember she mentioned this and maybe one or two other things they went together um, I can't remember exactly what it was. So then we have this little glitter heart cabochon. Um, this is one of the things I can't remember what it goes to. It's just a little gold circle. It may go to this. Um, these are, this is a Brad and she has created these little round 
um, resin pieces on the ends. Um, she did a project and she used them for knobs. And I don't know if she has a name for these yet. Uh, but it's super pretty and glittery. And if you were used on a project, it would kind of look like a bubble. Like a bubblegum bubble. So that would be really fun. Let's see some more pearls. There's one of those um, pearl bows. A little white flat back star there. Another um, diamond. And then this is a little charm with three little balloons. Super adorable. So, yep, yeah, that is, um, that's my winnings for Miss Ivy Lee. Um, like I said, I'll have her linked below if you don't know who she is. Um, you should definitely go over and subscribe and check out her videos. She is so funny, so sweet. Um, she, she can tell some stories. She can sing. She just does it all, I'm telling you. She is super sweet. And um, I have been one of her subscribers since like way back when she didn't have very many subscribers. So, I uh, 100%, 100,000% support you, Miss Ivy and you know that girl. Love you. So, yeah, thank you so much for all of my prizes from your giveaways. Thank you for hosting the giveaways and allowing me the chance to participate. So, yeah, that's it, you guys. I will catch you on the next crafty video. Bye-bye.